Hey, what's up? Mubo here. Today in the lab, we've got Tromolo. Some of you guys might remember me talking about this a million years ago. Uh, it's been used on a couple of DSA remixes, as well as a couple of the tracks on Unsaved. And today, I brought it to MySpace, and what we're going to do is a quick overview of what it does and how it sounds. So first off, we've got a mix knob. This decides how much effect and how much initial signal inputs and outputs. And we've got the heart of the machine, the mutators, one, two, and three. Uh, what these do is these actually what affects the sound. So without further ado, here we go. Here's the sound, just straight up how it sounds right out of the synthesizer. I'm going to bring down the mix and you'll start to notice that the music is going to go in time with that blinking red light over there. We can speed it up or slow it down. Change the intensity. Add more. Bring a little bit more in the mix so it lays in the background that's not such an intense effect. So we can change the rates on all these and the depth and get like a, a whole bunch of different rhythmic uh, patterns going on in the background of your sounds. It's actually pretty badass. Um, then over here, we've got what I call the Transgate Mutator. This changes it from a nice analog, warm-sounding, pulsy thing to a definitive on-off gate like what you would use in a lot of dance music. Uh, you'll notice I used it in Shake the Disease on myspace.com, the VDN. Check it out. And again, you can mix in the other signal. Or use it fully transgated. Here's the analog. Flick the switch. there you have it, the Tromolo. Um, that's about it. Got to get a new faceplate for it, fix up a couple of the solder points, drink about 2,000 more Dr. Peppers, and I'm ready to rock, bitches. Also, I'm going to have a VST version downloadable off this site, so any of you out there that have a studio or anything like the new software with VSTs, you can have your very own Tromolo, courtesy of Lubo. Peace!